It is a completed pass that moves the ball towards the opponent's goal at least 10 yards from its farthest point in the last six passes. Or, regardless of what came before it, it can be a completed pass into the penalty area. It only includes the, the top 60% of the pitch. In other words, it is a pass where a player is taking a bit of a risk, is trying to move their team towards the opponent's goal. Um, here's a quick example of a progressive pass, in case that isn't clear. Uh, you would expect, probably, if you're a follower of the Premier League, to see that um, Cancelo comes through towards the top of these rankings. Here is Mr Cancelo making a progressive pass from more or less exactly on the halfway line looking to find I think it is Foden in, in this case um, running in behind or uh, running into the, into the channel of the Manchester United uh, defence so here is a good example of what we are talking about from real life and that is all for today. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please express that by leaving a like while you're there. You may as well subscribe to the channel. And while you're doing that, why not leave a comment? That was just a quick video to explain what is a progressive pass. You can see some other videos uh, going in more in depth on the topic and indeed revealing who are the best progressive pass passers in the Premier League. Uh, you can also check out some of my match analysis videos. Thank you and I'll see you next time.